welcome to this week's plan with me and my Erin Condren vertical neutral. The new planners are starting this week. I am so excited for it. So I do have my horizontal neutral over to my left. I did switch out of my, my horizontal happy planner and into the Erin Condren horizontal neutral. I'm not sure yet if I prefer this just because of the way these boxes are sectioned off, but I think I just need to get used to it. Um, anyway, it is about eight o'clock in the morning, uh, Monday morning, so I am on time. I do have some coffee over to my right, but if this is a bit of a mess, I am exhausted and that is why. Um, ultimate planner sale ended last night at midnight. I was up at midnight still, um, just working on some stuff and yeah, so, uh, thank you guys so, 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 so much for all of the support during the ultimate planner sale. Every single time, um, that I participate in one of those, I am just completely blown away by you guys. So thank you guys so much for that. Um, we are going to, or I today will be getting started on that. And then all week, um, we're going to be just busting like to get through all of those before I leave on Sunday to go to Disney. Um, so yeah, I don't know how the lighting is looking. I think it's okay. So I don't have a ton of stuff written down because the main thing for this week is going to be to finish up all of those orders. And that's a lot for us to get through the amount of orders that come in during UPS in a week is it's a lot. So, um, I don't have a ton of stuff written down. I'm kind of remembering though, as I'm like talking, um, I do have some things I am going to go ahead and probably not write as I lay everything down so that I can kind of go back in. This is my very first time obviously using, well, maybe not obviously. I know some people did like mock spreads, but using the newer planner. So I'm excited to kind of play around with it and see how it goes, especially because this is new. I personally could see really loving this. I may make stickers that kind of like go with this because having like four little like checked things down at the bottom or something like that. I think could actually work out um, really nicely. So it is the week of 4th of July as well. <laughs> There's just a lot happening this week. So I am gonna be using our fourth kit. Um, I personally don't really do any, and also it's a little bit messed up. This is one that I had like in the office as an oops kit. Um, I don't personally do anything for the 4th of July. I like to just stay home. I do normally go over to mom's, um, they cook, but like Ozzy is really scared because of the fireworks and everything. So normally I just stay home. Um, and that's what I'm going to do this year, especially because, um, we're trying to get through all of these orders. So I had mentioned, I believe I'm going to do my date covers really quickly in the vlog last week. Also there will be a vlog this week, but it's going to just be a longer one and it's going to go up at the end of the week. Um, instead of going up like today, I'm going to keep adding footage to it so that it's just one big like ultimate planner sale style vlog. So that will be going up. It's just, it's going to go up later. Um, I forgot what I was talking about. I'm not going to lie. You guys, it's so early. <laughs> I wanted to do this video so badly though, especially since it's the new planners. Um, yeah, I don't remember what I was saying. Okay, so first of all though, let me, where are the flags? There's no flags anymore. That's exciting, to be completely honest. So this obviously, this ordeal will need to be covered, but not having the flags, I really, really like that. I also really like having this little calendar down here and I don't really want to cover it up. Um, but I don't, I mean, I don't know how it's gonna look if it's not covered up. I'm sorry you guys, there's gonna be a ton of weird edits in this video because I have to drink this coffee as I like, go. Um, anyway, so I don't remember what it was that I was rambling on about, but I am going to go ahead and do, oh, you guys, it's so different. I'm going to do my date covers. Um, let me do those in a second and I'll zoom you guys in because it is like, they're going to have to be lined up a little bit differently. Let's do bottom washi first. Uh, oh. I'm going to pull mine down pretty low, not incredibly low but kind of low. There we go. Okay, that wasn't that bad. So we've got this happening. Let's go ahead and do the second strip here because I just want to see like what, I think when I watched a couple of these videos, yeah, it's still gonna show. Okay. 
So mine's crooked, as you can see. Uh, on this side, it's where it needs to be, but on this side, it's a little bit lower. I don't know if I think that's that big of a deal. I don't think it's gonna be that hard to cover. If you use little things, it's not gonna be any issue at all to cover. I think that instead of the way that I just put this down, what I would do like going forward is take my first strip of washi and actually line it with these, these lines, if you guys can see what I'm talking about right here. Um, I don't want to zoom and then unzoom. So you guys see this, instead of lining on the bottom, I would line um, on the top so that I'm making sure that I'm getting that covered and then not being so concerned about like the way that it goes on the bottom. So that's definitely what I would do going forward. Um, and then you wouldn't be worried about that issue, especially because I'm crooked. And I also actually think that that might help line stuff up a little bit less crooked. Um, gosh, I don't know if I should try to get that back up. I don't think I should, but, oh, okay, yeah, we can. So I'm gonna, ee, there we go, pull that back up really quickly. I'm not gonna pull up, well, maybe I will, my bottom piece. So lining that on these dots, why can I not lay anything down straight? Um, yeah, that I think will be much better. So I don't know if I can get this bottom sticker up, yeah. Okay, so that would work out much better. I cannot pull that bottom sticker up. I'm ripping stuff all over the place right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and just put this back where it was. Um, gosh, even more crooked than it was to begin with. Come on, there we go. And then I'm gonna just do the other side the exact same way. I'm gonna keep my bottom washi down just a bit, but definitely something to kind of keep in mind whenever you start on this planner. If you are starting on this planner, I would say definitely line from the top. Wow, look at that. I can't, I, there's nothing I can, I can't get it back up. This is why I plan at night. Um, not that that's much better. I don't feel like I ever do much better at night, but like first thing in the morning, whew, you guys. Anyway, there we go. Um, I love this bottom washi too. I'm so obsessed still with the way that this is done. You guys can let me know how you feel about it. I know I've been getting some comments about the reformats of the kits. Um, the thing is like general consensus is that everybody really likes the reformat, but then there are some people who don't. And unfortunately I can't like please everybody. Um, I actually agree with the people, I, let me, let me see how this is gonna, I, I'm just gonna do it on that dot, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay, so just on that dot is where I'm lining these. Um, the scalloped headers and the mini kits, I actually got some comments on um, in the Facebook group, but the thing is, I did a poll, and even on that post, some people came in and said they liked the scalloped. Um, I did a poll, and everybody said that they preferred the scalloped headers over me switching them over into glitter headers. So I personally pre don't prefer the scalloped headers, um, and for this I actually have a deluxe kit, although this is an old, yeah, so this one has the glitter headers. Um, yeah, I, I also don't really care to have that many scalloped headers. I think that the scalloped headers are very cute. I don't like how they look over the checklists, and I don't like how they look over the full boxes. I think to do like one row of them is really cute, but then, after that, for me personally, it becomes too much. Um, I may do some more polls in a bit, you know, just to see, but I, I did do a poll right after um, I planned for the first time using one of the mini kits, and majority said that they wanted to keep the scalloped headers, so that's what I did. Um, but yeah, so anyway, date covers, those were not difficult to do. They were not difficult to line up at all. I will say I'm not the biggest fan of this little guy right here, but I believe that that's just for the first of the month, yeah. So for the rest, I think that that actually looks really nice up top, and I prefer that it does not have the month right here just kind of like sticking out, and it doesn't have the flags. So let's go ahead, and I'm gonna zoom you guys in because you've been a bit far out. Um, let's get started on the sidebar and kind of see how like covering all of that goes. Okay, so normally I would put my quote box up top. I'm not gonna do that because this one is the 4th of July one. So I'm gonna start with, let's do a glitter header at the very top, but I'm gonna do my box probably first because I need to see how to line this. Um, I'm gonna just do, how many do I have here? 
Okay, so I'm trying to think to space like the ones that have the double like layers and everything. Let's do the strawberry. Okay. So <laughs> I'm trying to see if this is the same way that it normally is where these lines are not centered, but it looks like I think they are. Yeah. Right? Maybe not. Maybe I'm here. No, come on. Okay. I'm going to pull it down just a bit. So I'm centering my box in these lines. And I mean, it kind of looks like they're centered. Does anybody know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> you know, the... <laughs> the older planner you had to like center in between the lines in order to get it centered you guys know what i'm saying right i don't feel like this one's that way although i just made that so incredibly crooked but these are actually correct i think you guys tell me if i'm wrong okay i don't like this up here so i'm gonna remove this glitter header um i don't it just something seems weird about this. I think it's because there's no flag maybe. Something about it just looks off to me. Um, but I think it's because there's no flag. So underneath that, I am gonna go ahead and do a glitter header. I am gonna space stuff a little bit also because I really messed up the spacing up top. So I wanna do a couple of trackers. Um, I've been using trackers just a little bit more lately. So the first one that I'm going to put down will be for running and then the second one will be for Oz. Um, why can I not lay anything down straight? You guys know I normally take Oz to the LAKE every single day. It has been so hot lately though that I've he hasn't been going some days. So I want to kind of be able to keep track. Um, so I've just been using, that, that's what I've been using them for. Underneath that, I'm gonna go ahead and put in a weekly tracker. I'm not 100% sure what I'm gonna use this for yet, um, but I definitely will use it, so. And then I've got all of this space. I think I put this up incredibly high. I think that that's where like this is looking really strange to me. But I didn't. So if you guys can see where this ends way up here, I guess that that's kind of like the new thing is the box has to go up super, yeah, it's gonna have to go up so high in order to cover that. So there's way more room in the sidebar now. <laughs> um, okay, let me do some three heart checklists probably in here. So I've got obviously some stuff that needs to um, happen before we leave for Florida. So I'm gonna end up using these for that. So I've got a couple of the, again, this is the deluxe kit that I'm using. I would not normally use the deluxe kit, but this was an oops that I had um, just in the office and I realized I didn't have something for the fourth. So I'm gonna use a glitter header and then one of either these two or three bow checklists. So it looks like if I did the two bow checklists, I could keep my calendar showing. And I kind of want to. Yeah, I'm gonna try it that way this week. So I'm gonna do one of these. And then that actually ends up making like just the perfect sidebar to keep that calendar showing other than the fact that it's all crooked. Oh, if it wasn't crooked, it would be, it would be perfect. So I'm gonna undo that, put it down on that line and then move my glitter header um, down just a bit. Yeah. I really like having this calendar to see. I know a lot of people really disliked it, but for me personally, I I don't know. I would love it if there was an option like that I could design a sticker to match every single kit to go down here. Obviously that can't happen though because everybody is using these kits in different times. If it was something like this, I could see making one to match July, but for like a normal kit, like Bloom or Galaxy or something like that that could be used at any time, there's just no way to do that. Um, I mean, I could always, no, actually no. I was gonna say I could make a neutral one, but the thing is, it's already neutral. I just, I don't see a need for that. So that is what the sidebar is looking like in the new planner for me for this week. I really like this. Um, yeah. 
You guys let me know down below, how do you feel about this little calendar? And I like that it's at the bottom instead of at the top. I don't like how that has to go up so high, but I'll get used to that, that's just different. Okay, so I'm gonna zoom you guys in just a little bit closer and we will get started on the week. Okay guys, I am so excited for like these lines versus what they were. So I want to go ahead and do, I'm gonna do a row of glitter headers all the way across the top. I'm gonna go ahead and speed you guys through that. Okay, so I have got my glitter headers down. So the next thing I'm gonna do, I guess, I guess I'm gonna put my full boxes down and I'm hoping that the way that these are now, that the full boxes just fit within this, but we'll see. So I'm gonna do, let's do my cupcake up top. I'm gonna go back and forth with my full boxes the way that I normally do. Okay, so no, this is, the spacing for these is not, <laughs> it, it's not the way that I thought it might be. Um, okay, so, let's do a glitter header under here. And I wonder if that's because of the way that I did my date covers. You know, I think that, so I, I, okay, I did my date covers totally wrong. So I think that right here, which is where I started my date cover, that's actually where the glitter header should have gone, and then the date cover should have gone above that, and then I bet this would have lined up better. I think that that's what happened. So that's totally fine for this week, and then next week I will try it that way and see if maybe that's kind of what, what happened. So um, let's go ahead and line up to the best of my ability, the glitter headers to that glitter header. And then I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna flip just so I can get these where I want it. I'm gonna go ahead and put in my other full boxes. Um, this week is gonna be just so much work that I'm not totally sure how much I really need in here. I actually kind of considered putting in my bow checklist. Actually, I could still do that. You know, I might do that. I may go ahead and put these in um, and have kind of like no white space for this week. Let's do that. Just because I've got a lot of stuff this week that I could like actually, I'm not gonna check stuff off of these, but that is like a list. Am I making sense? I shouldn't film so early in the morning. Um, okay, so let's do it that way. And then I'm gonna move my glitter headers because I've messed them up. Uh, let's do... Whoa, that one's way off. How many people are still planning no white space? You guys let me know in the comments below. Are you planning white space or no white space? I feel like the only thing I'm ever seeing anymore is no white space. But maybe I'm just not seeing everything. I mean, obviously I'm not seeing everything. Oh goodness, okay, so let's put in, yeah. Okay, I will say, like, as far as the bow stuff goes, um, talking about the scalloped bow headers and everything, I am obsessed still with these, as well as with the checklist, like these. Um, these are the smaller ones, obviously, in the deluxe kit, but the larger for the mini kit, like, I love those. I think it's just that the mix of all of it together, like, if it was this plus a scalloped bow header, like, that to me, it's a little bit much, but... That's just me going back to that again though. Okay, so let's do full boxes. It's been so long since I've had no, I'm gonna zoom you guys out. I feel like with me having these boxes and stuff, it's not quite necessary to be so close. Um, it's been so long since I've done no white space. It feels a little bit strange. I will also say that with this being up so high, I think it would look a lot better once these also got moved up that high. I just put everything down wrong is what happened. Okay, let's do full boxes. Sorry guys, like I said, there's gonna be a bunch of really just weird cuts. Hopefully when I edit it, I can make it like seamless, but between like the coffee and the fact that I'm doing, like it's morning and in the morning, I have so much to do on like social media and emails and stuff. So that's kind of like what I'm doing over here. I have to keep stopping um, to both drink some coffee and to go into my phone and like respond to some stuff. So that's, hopefully the edits will be okay, but I have to keep stopping. Anyway, let's move on. So full boxes. I want to do, so I've got these two girls and I want to kind of space them. So I'm going to go ahead and put the first one 
over here and I will put the other one on the second half of the week. Although she is in, she's in one of these boxes. I don't wanna do that. We'll put her on the second half of the week. Let's do this one. So I'm trying to do color wise. So I've got light blue, I've got dark and red. So I need a red for over here. Let's do the bathing suit, which has both blue and red, but that's okay. Um, anyway, so for the 4th of July, I don't normally go out and do something. When I was younger, I would, um, the thing is, like, I have Ozzy now, who does okay with fireworks like that. He's scared of random things. He's not really scared of what he should be afraid of, but, um, I worry that maybe he will, you know, be scared of them, and I don't want him to be here by himself, like, while I go watch them, so I'd rather just stay here with him. Um, <clears throat> also I live in the South. I don't know if this is a thing anywhere else, but people will be shooting off fireworks at like all hours of the night, um, in the street, you know, I, so I, I need to be here anyway. Um, like, it's not like I could go out, you know, before or after and feel okay about leaving Ozzy. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. Um, but I do normally go over my camera just cut off. I do normally go over to mom's. They do normally cook and I take, I'll take Ozzy with me, obviously, when I go to do that. Um, but as far as going out for anything else, like as much as I would like to, because at the lake that I go run at, they actually have fireworks there. I would love to go there and watch them. I just, I feel really bad about leaving Ozzy. So I will be home um, or I'll be at mom's. Also, we can normally see them from mom's house, like the ones that they're shooting in Asheville. Mom lives pretty high up, so we can normally see them from her back porch. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and finish my like full box and checklist. So I'm just gonna go ahead and flip. So for the fourth, I'm using the box that says the fourth. And then I'm gonna go ahead and put uh, these glitter headers on my hand. I it seriously has been so long since I've done no white space and honestly, it's still gonna have a little bit of white space down here, but I kind of love it and I kind of miss it. Um, hopefully I'm not about to go back to doing it, but I, I don't think I'd be mad about it. I also really enjoy having checklists because that's kind of what my horizontal is. I'm being too rambly, I need to get moving. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and do my box right here. And I can just, I can see my phone blowing up, you guys. I have to stop to deal with this. Okay, um, I've mentioned a couple of times now, I don't, maybe in the vlog, maybe in videos, or like plan with me, I'm not sure, but I am um, a moderator currently for the Ultimate Planner Sale group, so that is what I keep doing. <laughs> um, anyway, so like I said, the sale just ended um, at midnight, and some people are extending their sale, so when this goes up, if you didn't get a chance, I'm not extending, but if you didn't get a chance to shop and you were still wanting to, um, a ton of the shops do extend their sales um, for the next couple of days. So you can kind of just go over to the Ultimate Planner Sales um, Facebook group and you can see uh, where people will be posting that they are extending their sales if you didn't get to shop. But I am not gonna extend, um, obviously, because I've got to get through all these orders before I leave for Florida. So uh, let's do... Okay, I need to do the back and forth now with these boxes that have, I should not have laid that down the way that I did, that have the outlines. Okay, so we're gonna do her down here. And then let's do, I'm gonna not use the one with the nails. I think that it's super cute, but I wanna use the fireworks, so. And normally what I would have done is use um, this box right here over on my sidebar. I normally do two in my sidebar because I don't do two weekly trackers. So let's do that one there. And then I will be doing this one down at the bottom. So I wanna do, I'm kind of going back with my colors. Um, so instead of, <laughs> Instead of doing the same colors the same way, am I making any sense at all? I'm actually doing <laughs> like, oh my goodness, going backwards with them. What is the word that I want here? You know, like the dark blue was on the first here. It's gonna be on the last here. I, I can't, you guys, it's too early. 
Um, so now that these planners don't have these flags, do we want to get rid of these larger ones or are you guys using those for something else? Um, I use flags pretty often when I'm doing no white space, but I'm normally using like our $2 Tuesday ones with the foil. I generally end up pulling a lot of those, depending. It depends on the kit that I'm using. If I'm using a mini kit from another shop that doesn't have like as many full boxes, or not full boxes, but half boxes and whatnot, like what I would normally want, that's when I would get a bunch of those flags and start using them. But you guys just let me know. I don't feel like there needs to be like a huge reformat because of the change in the planner or anything, but if there are some things that could get swapped out since they're not really necessary anymore, you guys just let me know. Okay, so let's just take a little look at how crooked this gets down, yeah. Oh boy. Okay. So that is what, um, the top halves are looking like. Let me open this up. Also, does anybody just love how small the new planner feels when it's not full of stickers? Oh, you guys, I'm not gonna lie. I love how this is looking like love it, but there's not a ton of room down here, which actually for what I'm doing this week is probably totally fine. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started on the very bottom. Okay, so I'm gonna kind of pull this over. I'm using this with no stickers, obviously, as you guys can see. Um, but I may play around with the idea of maybe some horizontal kits. I'm not 100% sure, um, but I, I might play around with the idea. I don't know if I will personally use them, but it's been so long since I've had one of these that I could use for sizing that I may, I may do that. Um, also, I'm still like, it, it's still in the back of my mind to do some stuff for Happy Planner. It's just taking me forever. Um, I'm, I can't get caught up enough to where I've got the time to sit down and design like a totally new kit. Um, I may end up, you guys let me know, I may do like a sheet of full boxes that could be swapped that are Happy Planner size. Would that be enough if I just changed the full boxes to be the correct? size, you guys let me know. I don't wanna do like an entirely different kit. I think the bottom washi is the same. I think everything else would be the same I'm other than these, but I don't know if I could, I don't know. You guys let me know. Let's move on. So for today, Monday, you guys, I keep writing stuff down in my horizontal. So the first thing I'm gonna do down here at the very bottom, I have a doctor's appointment at three. So I'm gonna go ahead and stick in an appointment label. And then I need to do, I've got deliveries coming. I've got a lot happening today. Let's go ahead and put in this box and this can be for all of my deliveries. Let me find, you know, I do this every single time. Why is there not a package icon in my kits? Every single time. I've got a present. I'm probably going to do that. And then down at the very bottom, I am going to do... I'm going to just do one of these, like, flags. Yeah. Okay, so <clears throat> you can see this dot right here, and if I would have moved the washi up, then you wouldn't be able to, and I think it would have been fine, but everything on this page needed to scoot up uh, just a little bit. So I think once that happened, it would be totally fine. I'm not a fan of being able to see that, but again, I don't think you'll be able to. So I like how this looks. I don't have an issue with this. So I've got a doctor's appointment at three, like I said. I've got a paper delivery coming. I've got a massive supply delivery from Amazon, hopefully showing up because it's late. It was supposed to be here Saturday. I do have Prime. Um, I don't know how this happened, but they're saying to contact them if it's not here by Wednesday, and I'm just over here like, oh, it was supposed to be here Saturday. Can you guys like, you know, I know it's not their fault, but anyway. And then I've got HelloFresh coming today as well. So that is what all of my little boxes are for. For the rest of the week, there's probably just gonna be boxes put in that I'll have to figure out later on what I'm gonna be using them for. 
because I feel like today is kind of the only day that I've got like a real schedule happening other than just for work. Okay, so for Tuesday, we will not have a $2 Tuesday this week. Um, just obviously, it's there's no way. So I am going to probably just put in some stuff, like some boxes to be honest, and then I will be able to go in uh, later on and just kind of fill out you know, whatever I need when I realize what I need. So let's do just one of those. We'll do one of these. And then down at the very bottom, Tuesday is normally girls' night. I don't think that's gonna happen this week. Um, actually, it can't happen this week. I just realized I've got other stuff that I've got to do on Tuesday. Never mind. So moving over to Wednesday, I will say on Tuesday that I could put in. I've got bills like today's the first, so technically today. And also tomorrow and also Thursday, so I could put in, yeah, we'll do that. There, okay. So moving over to Wednesday, I'm gonna just, that's my Keurig, by the way, I'm making more coffee. Um, okay, I think it's done. So let's do for Wednesday, I'm gonna do a box here. I'm just, I'm putting boxes in, I mean, just to have. I love these really tiny labels, and I'm just gonna leave that that way. Honestly, this is looking like a bit much for all of this happening at the bottom. I was just trying to cover that, so. Uh, moving over to Thursday, I do, okay, so I'm, I don't know if we're gonna have a new release this Friday. I think we might, to be honest, I think we might, but I don't know for 100%. Um, if we do not have one this Friday, we will have one the Friday that I'm in Disney. So I have got things ready to go. Um, I, I believe I mentioned that. For Ultimate Planner Sale, I actually had like three fall kit or four fall kits ready to release and then decided that I didn't want to overwhelm myself that way. Um, so we did not release all of them, but they're ready to go. So I want to go ahead and get them up for I guess either this Friday or they'll be going up the Friday that I'm in Disney. I may split them up. The thing is, I'm not gonna be here all week next week. So processing times, I mean, I don't know. I'm gonna have to figure that out. Um, I. The thing is with releasing stuff while I'm not here, I don't have so much of an issue with that if it's not during a huge sale, like Ultimate Planner sale. Um, I don't have a, a, a huge issue because, I mean, obviously, like, yeah, we, we're gonna sell kits, but they're not gonna be, it's not gonna be the way that it would be if it was for your, you know, UPS. So, let's do, I don't know if I like how matchy all of that is. For Friday, I'm gonna put down both of these, well, both of these. Okay. Anyway, so I don't know, we'll, we'll figure out what it is. I'm gonna have everything ready to go. I'll have the new release videos done, hopefully. It's really gonna depend on how, like, how I'm able to get through these orders, which I'm about to go pick list as soon as I'm done filming this video, and we have already gotten started. You guys will see that in the vlog. Like, the fall kits for Glossy, already almost done. A lot of the new hobo kits, done. Um, so we, we have been working through stuff. It's just, oh, I hate that I didn't use any of these. Can we, yeah. Um, so yeah, that's just what's gonna happen. It's obviously the processing times are gonna be a little bit higher. Um, I may up our processing times while I'm gone to two to three weeks, and then it probably isn't gonna take that long, but just in case it does, you know, at least we'll have that. So, over here ripping up stickers. Um, I'll keep you guys, you know, updated, and we'll, we'll figure out what's going on. I just don't wanna kinda like fall behind on releasing stuff and then have like one massive release where it's gonna really like throw everything off. So yeah, let me zoom you guys back out and I will show you the finished spread. Okay guys, so this is the finished spread. I love this silver glitter hollow foil. So that's another thing that's supposed to be here like today. Where's my foil order? You guys, I feel like everything is running incredibly late. Like I did such like, I made sure to have everything 
ordered so that it would be here like before I have to go so that I won't run out of anything. Am I making sense? So that I wouldn't run out of anything and none of it is actually like showing up. Like, okay, so my foil is gonna be here tomorrow and I don't think we're close to running out of anything, so that's fine. Anyway, this is the finished spread. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm sorry if it was all over the place. It is really early in the morning. Um, yeah, if you enjoyed, give this video a thumbs up and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye guys.